Hey guys, and welcome back. We've been going through a Toyota Tacoma series where I've showed a lot of modifications I've done to my truck, the way I camp in my truck, and how I've been hitting the road doing some boondocking. But what I haven't covered is how I carry my bike. I have two different ways to do that. I've got a bike rack and a way I put the bike inside of the truck cap to make sure it's safe. We're gonna go ahead and run through those things right now for you. This rack allows me to put any two bikes that I want on the back of the truck with no problem. This also allows me to hinge the bikes out of the way to gain entry to the back of the truck. And this is something that's highly important for anyone that's gonna do any truck camping. So this is the perfect fit for someone that is going to do overlanding or do a lot of things out of the back of the vehicle while carrying two bikes. To engage the hinge system, you start by spinning out a large lever on the outside. A small pop pin on the inside. Pop, pull. You're gonna to wanna to go ahead and rotate this into the locked position. The swing rack allows me to go in and out of the back of the truck without removing the bikes. Allows me to climb in bed without having to take the bikes off of the rack. To bring the bikes in, you release the center pin here by pulling up, it hinges. You grab the outside pin lift and pivot them back straight to engage the swing. Pushing the bikes back into place, ensuring that the front pin is dropped in. Now screw the handle back in. I would do this part as tight as you can. Now that we've run down how the rack works and why I chose that rack, let's go ahead and talk about how I put the bike inside the truck. I have to take the front wheel off of the bike and I can slide it onto one side of the truck with my bed locking it in place. So now my bike is inside the truck, locked, safe, and out of the weather conditions, depending on what's going on. Sometimes when I go out, I don't even use my bike, but I never go out without my bike. Always put your front axle back to your fork unless you want to buy another one. Another great reason to have the side windows that flop up is you can pick the window up to slide your bed in without any struggle. All the pieces slide in and lock in right next to the bike. Today, we're actually in a place where the bike rack's not gonna work. So, I'm putting the bike inside the truck, I'm gonna go meet up with my buddy Seth and my buddy Pat, and we're gonna do a little off-roading. I hate to get you guys all hyped up, but you're gonna have to wait till next time. Asheville's waking up, we're headed out I-40. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and here's a little teaser for what you're gonna get in the next Tacoma video. Wait, stop for a second and let's uh Oh son! He's all the way on the other side of the rut. Oh, that's bad. 